Let's watch. Rudy Giuliani accused of sexual assault, harassment, harassment, wage theft, and other misconduct Trump in a new ally lawsuit. Trump ally Rudy Giuliani is the target of a new lawsuit accusing him of sexual assault, harassment, wage theft, and other misconduct. And they're asking for $10 million in damages. The woman who filed the suit says she worked for the former New York mayor for nearly two years and claims that he offered her the job, quote, as a pretext to develop a quid pro quo sexual relationship. Giuliani spokesperson says he unequivocally denies these allegations. Elaine. Yeah, if only there was like uh, Rudy Giuliani being a fucking sex pest on camera. In like, uh, I don't know, uh, a, a relatively successful movie. That was uh, done by some British dude uh, by the name of Sasha Baron Cohen. I know I'm being oddly specific because like that already exists out there. Kahano has more on this story. The wide-ranging lawsuit against Rudy Giuliani was filed in a New York court Monday. In it, plaintiff Noel Dunphy claims Giuliani offered her a job in January 2019 as his director of business development with a salary of a million dollars a year, but said he'd have to defer her pay and keep her employment secret until he finished divorce proceedings with his now ex-wife. Over the nearly two years that followed, Dunphy claims Giuliani paid her almost exclusively in cash, made clear that satisfying his sexual demands was an absolute requirement of her employment, forced her to perform a variety of sexual acts, and breached their alleged business agreement. This sounds like unhinged because uh, of like how severe the accusations are a little bit, except that we've seen him on camera behave in this way. And also on top of that, a lot of this stuff is recorded. So it's not unhinged. Even if you think it is, I'm telling you right now, it's not even like a believe women type uh, situation here that I'm presenting. It's that apparently a lot of this shit is on the record. And I'm not even talking about Borat 2, man, even though we will watch this. Okay. This is a separate incident. Mm, mm, mm. Nice to meet you, my dear. Nice to meet you. You are one of my greatest heroes. Oh, oh, that's so nice. Thank yes. you. Thank you. I will try my best, but because I'm super excited and nervous. I'm... Well, you relax. I'll relax. You want me to ask you questions? <laughs> <laughs> I'll relax you, okay? Yes. Thank you. I feel like I'm living in a fairy tale. Fair. You're going to do great, okay? So, please take Riz. this. It used to belong to my father, but I think you should keep it. Oh, my God, that's wonderful that you gave this to me. So, uh, well, thank you, my dear. A little bit about China. As an expert of national security, what do you think we can do going forward to prevent this from happening again? Well, well China manufactured the virus and let it out. And they deliberately spread it all around the world. I don't think anybody was eating bats. Yeah. Did you ever have a bat? Oh, no, I don't think I'll ever <laughs> to eat a bat. If you eat a bat with me. OK, I will I'll eat a bat with you. <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> so probably in a rough estimate, how many lives President Trump saves? I'd say he saved a million lives. It would have been a million more had he had he waited that month the way the Democrats would have done. Yeah. Uh, but he acted swiftly. He acted before anybody. In fact, even his own even his own advisors, some of them advised really? him not to do it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm oh, good. So fucking gross. Yeah. <laughs> there it's always good. Never been in front of the camera. I've always been behind of the camera, but today something uh, with I this. I think you're going to look pretty good. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, you're going to look pretty but good. But it's because of you. Well, thank you. I really feel like Melania right now. Well, you're doing very well. You gotta look Sorry to interrupt, Mayor. Uh, sound problem. I think we cancel interview. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't think we need. Uh, because yeah, what do I do? I, just I, check I've already Mike. checked. Okay. Is that better? Yeah, that's a bit better. Let me just listen in for a bit. Yeah. Is she asking too many questions? No, she's doing great. She'd make a very nagging wife. No. If I were you, I would stick to marrying your cousins. Let me check the sound. Can I check the sound? Sure. Uh... Mr. Mayor, can, can you say something? Can you say something? 
Yes, I'm fine. Yeah, the sound is perfect. It's probably please, better please, if I stay leave. in. No, no, please. If I need you, I will call you. you sure. You will be in the lobby, right? I'm so sorry. That's no, horrible. Sit, down. sit, 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 sit. Okay. I'm so sorry for that. Really, I apologize. The apology accepted. No problem. Okay. Okay? Yeah. Uh, thank you again for giving me this time. Shall we have a drink in the bedroom? Uh oh. What happened? There you go, my dear. Okay. That you can be good. You can give me your phone number and your address. Should we slip your jacket? Okay. Put down your crumb. Oh. She's 15. She's too old for you. What, what, she, why are you just no, like she's my daughter. Please, take me instead. Take my anus. No, 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 take my anus. Do not have her. I'm better than him. No, I better. My back pussy very tight. No, please. My cross oh, anus. Please, I will let you enjoy my crumb in your mouth. Please. Please. No, I better. I, I, would love to I was in you. prison many years, so I have techniques with my mouth. Hello, what's going on here? Look at this guy. I forbid this union. Rudy, Trump will be disappointed. You are leaving hotel without golden shower. Rudy Giuliani thought she was underage, by the way, and did that. So remember that. Um, and it's great because they actually use this. Amazing actual excerpt from the suit against Rudolph Giuliani implicitly confirming that the scene in Barat was exactly what it looked like. But Giuliani would not leave. He sat on the bed and pulled down his pants. The following screenshot from the film Barat subsequent movie film depicts Giuliani acting in a similar manner to how he acted with Miss Dumphy. That's in a, that was a real scenario that uh, Sasha Baron Cohen set up for him. And, uh, and ironically, that is, or I guess unsurprisingly, that is exactly how he fucking operates in real life. Just like that was a, a moment that he didn't realize it was you know, being filmed on camera, right? But it basically confirms his fucking M.O., And then they used it in the fucking court proceedings, dude. They used it in the fucking... I mean, god damn, dude. I love stuff like this when, when uh, you know, movies and shit like that help uh, aid and, and uh, taking down actual criminals in the real world that are behaving in this, like, insane, uh, awful, gross, disgusting manner. I'm a big sucker for that. I know Sasha Baron Cohen is a big lib and all this shit, but like, ultimately this makes up for everything else. But yeah, here's some of the stuff. Agreement. Dunphy claims to have recorded many of her interactions with Giuliani, including one where she says he told her, I've wanted you from the day I interviewed you. Attorney Justin Kelton represents her. She alleges that on several occasions she objected uh, clearly that he did not respect those objections. The lawsuit also alleges Giuliani, a personal attorney to then President Trump, told Dunphy Trump's team would claim there was voter fraud if he lost the 2020 election. In another instance, Giuliani allegedly said he was selling pardons for $2 million, which he and President Trump would split. There has been no proof of voter fraud in that election, nor evidence that Giuliani or the former president were ever compensated for pardons during his time in office. CBS News has reached out for comment from the former president, but has not heard back. In a statement, a spokesperson for Giuliani said he did. Dude, I love that. Denies the allegations Get and your will money pursue up, all King. available remedies and counterclaims. In response, Dunphy's lawyer said in part that Giuliani, quote, will have to answer to materials and recorded statements that will be presented at trial. CBS News legal analyst Ricky Kleeman. The real evidence in this case for this complaint to move forward has to be in the recordings. Because if it's not in the recordings, it does hit the line of being so over the top that you wonder if it's all true or if none of it is true. And that's going to be the defendant's argument. For CBS Mornings, I'm Elaine Quijano.
This morning, Florida Governor Ron DeSantis. I believe it. One, because I want to believe it. And two, because I've seen how he behaves on camera. You know what I mean?